And I got muscles now, yo. Oh, where? Yeah. I'm just <laughs> It's Liv. I'm here with my boy React It Up, Dante. We're finally doing a collab. No, I got a little small YouTube channel. You go, you go ahead and make sure you subscribe to it. It's going to be we'll right, there. It right there. right <laughs> there. Don't forget to put it right there. I won't. I won't. So today is a little bit different because we're going to be talking about things that we wish we knew in high school from my perspective and from his perspective. My perspective is the right one, you know what I'm saying? Right. Because, right. you know, guys are always right. Right. Hey, if you think guys are always right, comment guys are always right down in the comment nah, box. Nah, nah. Comment girls are always right because women power, you know, right? So the first point that I want to cover is that high school is not that important. And I'm referring to your social life. So it doesn't matter what, pe what people say about you. Just be yourself. And I know it's kind of like, you know, a social hierarchy. But just, just be yourself. Like, am I right? I mean... How do you feel about that? I, I think you should be yourself. But, like, in mm -hmm. high school, like, I... Good status, like the good status. Yeah, the status, of like important. yeah. That but that goes away once you leave high school. And that is go. true. Then you gotta do it again. Oh, that's a good point. Yeah, you go to college <laughs> and you're like, you you have to start all over, but you just gotta have that juice. You know, you gotta have the juice. Like, all right, yeah. all right, that's a fair point. So the second point is that you shouldn't stress yourself out over having like 50 plus friends because like I had a lot of friends in high school, but I realized that I was just friends with them because I saw them like every day at school. So whenever I went to college, they just kind of like dispersed and we did our own thing and we don't really talk anymore. So I have like a solid five, so five or so friends that I talk to, but I mean, I mean, that, that kind of happened to me, too. Like, I had a yeah. lot of friends. I had a lot of friends in high school. Like, having a lot of friends, like, you had a lot of different, like, types of friends, like, different, like, things about them. And so, like, that allowed you to, like, see, like, what type of friend you like the best, like, the most. That's true. So then, even though they dropped off after high school, the ones that you, like, stayed close with after high school are obviously, like, the type of friends that you like. The true friends. The true like, friends. The and ones. it allows you to, like, see their true colors. So I think that it was nice to, like, that's, that's, yeah. have a lot of friends just to, like, see who your true friends are. That's a good way to Versus look at if it. you only get have five friends in high school, what if none of those turn out to be true friends? And you, you got no, no friends. friends, yeah. So look here. She thinks that if you like somebody, you should just go up and tell them. You should. Be blunt. Be be straightforward. I don't know. I, don't I mean, I know there's rejection, the fear of rejection there, but like, wouldn't you be happy to like look back on it and be glad that you tried, you know? Versus saying, oh darn, we'll never know how that no. could have been. You feel me? I'm not the type <laughs> I'm not the type to just come up to you and just be like, I like you. I'm the type to like throw little hints out there just to like make you wonder, you know, like and it like it builds it up and then you know like when it builds up, if something happens it's like more exciting versus if I just come up to you like I like you. Okay, like don't say it like that. <laughs> <Yeah>. I like <laughs> it. You would just go and say I like you. Mm -hmm. Maybe not exactly those words. I would, I would like give them like the like the girl look. The girl know? look. The girl look, where they're like, "Ooh, I like you." Do I get but that like, look? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> I still feel like you should you should be blunt with someone, but not to where it makes you both uncomfortable. So you should tell them how you feel, but like you know, start out as friends. Yeah. Start start as friends and just you know, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you study in high school. Did I study in high school? Yeah, did you study in high school? No. No? See, I didn't either. See, that's why we are moving on to the next point of that I wish I studied more in high school because I wasn't like, I didn't feel prepped enough to study for college because that's a lot of work, I feel like. Yeah, I'm still, I'm still struggling studying in college. Right. Like, it's, it's okay, hard. I like it's, too. I, it's, it my time hard. management is horrible. Me too. That's like another thing to mention, like work on your time management, like make sure you have your stuff organized because you're gonna need to know like yes yeah, it's, it's hard to, to like do things it's hard to balance studying and texting you back you know oh. it's hard i should have studied <laughs> in high school and like even when i do study i get like off track like i'll be studying and yeah, next I you do know get i'm like oh let me watch this tv show yeah. real quick. oh let me take a quick nap oh this quick. youtube video i gotta watch that then next like, thing you know the test is like the next night the next day and you're like oh that's when you cram and, and this sucks and yeah cramming better. is like not the best thing in college i mean you'll probably do it but like I've done yeah, it, but. everybody's gonna do it <laughs> Every, everyone's gonna do it but like you'll you'll find out for yourselves whenever you get there but like yeah just try and study if you can and high school but I know like no one wants to hear that but I'm serious like it's gonna help you in college I miss I, I miss my family I'm I, close to my family though I am too I'm close to my family like I'm a mama's boy like oh, I love my dad and my mom yeah. but I'm a mama's boy I love mm -hmm. my sisters but it's also like like I had a curfew 
back at when I lived at See, home. See, I did too. My mom was my, always my like, was be nine back o'clock. by 10. Nine o'clock. Nine o'clock on weekends. On weekends. So, like, yeah, so I couldn't do anything. So like okay. when I went to college and I had my own place, I had my own car. It was just it's cool to like be the able to freedom. yeah the freedom. So, but when so I go fun. home, I'm, I'm happy to be with my family. But like yeah. living there. Do you still have a curfew now when you go back? No, but even if I'm okay. out past nine, my mom's calling me like, really? hey, I'm worried about you. Oh, that's that's good though. Your parents like still care about you and everything. Enjoy the time that you have with your family. If you're close with your parents and stuff, like enjoy those home cooked meals because when you get to college, no one's gonna be cooking for you. Like it's just it's all on you. I, mean, I don't know. Fresh Unless food. you go game fifteen like me, you know what I'm saying? I got muscles now, you know. We're you know, out yeah. where. <laughs> I said you couldn't be savage earlier. You got me. See, I have my savage moments. So I hope you guys enjoyed that video, you know? Yes. I was a guest. If you guys want to see me in more videos, tell me in the comment box below. Yeah. And also, like come over to my channel. Yes. We're going to put it right here again if you missed it in the earlier part of the video to go subscribe to my boy's channel. So go click that button right there. Click that button right now. Do it, do it. And last but not least, I hope you guys have a super awesome, fantastic, splendid, amazing day. It does. <laughs> <laughs>